Have you ever wondered why some people always seem to have money, while others struggle to save? The difference often isn't about how much they earn, it's about how they spend. Frugal people know a secret. It's not about cutting back on everything, but about making smart choices with their money. They avoid wasting money on things that don't add real value to their lives. Instead, they focus on spending wisely and saving more. By doing this, they can build wealth over time and work toward financial independence. What do they refuse to buy? It's not just about pinching pennies. It's about understanding the bigger picture of personal finance. In this video, I'll show you six things frugal people avoid buying. These choices not only help them save money, but also bring them closer to their financial goals. If you're ready to learn how to make better money decisions and take control of your finances, keep reading. Number one, high interest credit cards. Frugal people avoid using high interest credit cards because they know how quickly debt can pile up. Credit cards may seem convenient, but if you don't pay off the balance every month, the interest charges can grow fast. With high interest rates, sometimes as high as 20% or more, this type of debt can become a huge financial burden. Why do many people fall into this trap? Often, it's because they see credit cards as free money. It's easy to swipe and worry about paying later, but frugal people think differently. They understand that spending money you don't have can hurt your financial future. They prefer to pay with cash or use low interest credit cards only when absolutely necessary. This way, they avoid paying extra fees and interest that can quickly drain their bank accounts. High interest credit cards are one of the things poor people waste their money on because they make everyday purchases more expensive over time. Frugal people focus on saving money and avoiding this type of debt. They also know that using credit cards for rewards is only smart if they can pay off the balance in full each month, avoiding any interest charges. Instead of relying on credit, frugal people create budgets and spend only what they have. By avoiding high interest debt, they stay in control of their finances and work toward financial independence. This simple habit helps them save more and avoid the stress that comes with mounting credit card debt. In short, avoiding high interest credit cards is one of the smartest moves frugal people make to protect their wealth and future. Number two, trendy baby products. Frugal people avoid buying trendy baby products because they know that babies outgrow things quickly. Items like designer baby clothes, high-tech strollers, or expensive gadgets may look nice, but they don't add much value in the long run. Babies don't care about brands, and most of these trendy items are only used for a short time before they're no longer needed. Many parents fall into the trap of thinking that their baby needs the latest and best products. But the truth is, simple, practical items work just as well, if not better. For example, instead of buying a fancy crib, frugal parents may opt for a safe, affordable one that will last through multiple children. Instead of buying every new baby gadget, they focus on basic needs, like diapers, clothes, and a good car seat. Frugal people also know that buying secondhand baby items is a smart way to save money. Since babies grow so fast, used clothes, toys, and furniture are often in great condition and much cheaper than new items. The takeaway is clear. Babies don't need expensive, trendy products to be happy and healthy. By sticking to the essentials and buying secondhand when possible, frugal parents save money without sacrificing quality or safety. Number three, designer perfumes. Frugal people avoid buying expensive designer perfumes because they understand that high price doesn't always mean better value. Designer perfumes can cost hundreds of dollars for a small bottle, and while they may smell nice, they are often overpriced due to the brand name rather than the actual quality of the product. Many people buy designer perfumes because of the status or luxury they believe it represents. However, frugal people know that spending a lot of money on a fragrance doesn't make financial sense, especially when there are many affordable alternatives available. There are plenty of perfumes and body sprays that smell just as good but cost much less. These alternatives often last just as long and offer a great variety of scents without the hefty price tag. Frugal people also understand that perfumes are a personal choice and don't need to be based on a designer label. They prioritize spending their money on things that provide more long-term value, such as investing or saving, rather than splurging on expensive brands. The takeaway is clear. While designer perfumes might feel luxurious, they are not a smart way to spend money if you want to save. 
Frugal people focus on finding good quality alternatives that smell great and keep more money in their wallets. Number 4. Costly Professional Photo Shoots Frugal people often avoid spending money on expensive professional photo shoots. While it's nice to have high-quality photos, frugal individuals know that these services can be costly, especially when you consider how many affordable or even free alternatives exist. Hiring a professional photographer for family portraits, events, or personal photos can easily cost hundreds of dollars. For many, it's a luxury that adds up quickly. Frugal people understand that in the age of smartphones and easy-to-use cameras, it's possible to take great pictures without the high price tag. Instead of paying for a professional, they often take their own photos or ask friends and family members to help out. Additionally, frugal people realize that memories are more important than the quality of the photos themselves. As long as the moment is captured, the focus is on the experience, not on spending extra money for a perfect picture. The key takeaway is that while professional photo shoots may seem tempting, they aren't always necessary. Frugal people choose to save that money for more important financial goals, like building an emergency fund or paying off debt. By skipping costly photo shoots, they can enjoy memories without breaking the bank. Number 5. Expensive coffee and takeout meals Frugal people know that buying expensive coffee and takeout meals regularly can quickly drain your wallet. Many people don't realize how much money they spend on daily coffee runs or ordering food from restaurants until they add it up. Even small purchases, like a $5 coffee, every day, can add up to over $1,800 a year. This spending habit is often called the latte factor, a term used by personal finance expert David Bach. It shows how small, daily expenses, like coffee or fast food, can hurt your savings over time. While it might seem convenient to grab a quick coffee or order takeout for dinner, these purchases can really cut into your budget. Frugal people choose to make their coffee at home and prepare their meals in advance. By brewing coffee at home and planning meals, they save a lot of money over time. Meal prepping can also help avoid the temptation of ordering takeout when you're too tired to cook. A little effort can go a long way in keeping more money in your pocket. The key lesson here is that small changes, like making your own coffee or cooking meals at home, can lead to big savings. Instead of wasting money on expensive habits, frugal people focus on how these small savings can add up and bring them closer to their financial goals. Number 6. Unnecessary Home Upgrades and Decor Frugal people avoid spending money on unnecessary home upgrades and decor. While it's tempting to constantly redecorate or make changes to your home, these updates can quickly become expensive and don't always add real value. Many people feel pressure to keep their homes looking stylish, but frugal people know that focusing on what's functional and practical is more important. It's easy to waste money on trendy furniture, new paint colors, or home decor items that look good for a while but won't last long. Some people also spend large amounts of money on renovations that don't significantly improve their home's value. Frugal people, however, are careful about what they spend on their homes. They only make upgrades when it's necessary, like fixing something that's broken or improving energy efficiency. Instead of constantly buying new things to decorate, they focus on keeping their homes simple and functional. They choose quality items that last and avoid impulse purchases that don't serve a real purpose. The key takeaway here is that you don't need to spend a lot of money on home upgrades and decor to have a comfortable home. By prioritizing what truly matters and avoiding unnecessary spending, frugal people save money and keep their finances in check. These decisions are key steps toward achieving financial independence. By focusing on what truly matters and cutting out wasteful spending, frugal people are able to save more money and invest in their future. Financial independence isn't about being rich, it's about having control over your money. When you stop spending on things you don't need, you free up more cash for important goals, like building an emergency fund, paying off debt, or investing in your retirement. Every dollar saved is a step closer to financial security and freedom. Experts like Dave Ramsey and Warren Buffett emphasize that wealth isn't just about how much you earn, but how wisely you spend and save. The small changes frugal people make today lead to big rewards in the future. So, if you want to take control of your finances, start by rethinking where your money is going. By adopting these smart habits, you'll not only save money but also work toward a more secure and independent financial future.
Now, if you want to learn how to achieve financial success, then watch this video next. If you made it to this point in the video, please like and subscribe to the channel to see more content like this. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next